Yeah, my son built it for me. Amazing. What's up guys? Welcome back to the channel. It's a beautiful sunny day in Vancouver. We got a new e-bike build. This one's for Eli's mom. I'm gonna get Eli to talk about it. Hope you enjoy it, Gail. Okay, here it is. By far one of the most meaningful builds I've done. I love you, mom. Here you guys go. Check this badass girls bike. Doesn't get any crazier than this for the girls. This goes out to all the guys out there too because if you show your wives or your girlfriends this bike, it will get you guys out there riding, right? Okay, here it is. Give you some close-ups here. We'll start up here, I guess, with the handlebars. We got some medium ape hangers. Gives a really nice angle for the hands. Super comfortable positioning on this one, obviously. Um, it's got the Egronomical Brooks hand grips and over here the Magrua uh, front disc brake same thing 203 millimeter rotor four piston caliber and activation for regenerative braking is also done by the front brake lever of course your throttles on this side down here I got a couple extras for mom of course we got the time so you know what time it is we got the temperature, so you know what temperature it is. And so you don't forget to do what you got to do with the bike. Ride it like you stole it. Okay? This bike, it's definitely, you can ride it like you stole it. Dual motors. Okay? Dual motors. I did a basic setup for this one because we don't care about too much speed and too much power. Mom's going to be cruising around. All the ladies going to be cruising around. It's not about that kind of stuff. But it's about control and power okay it's got dual regenerative braking so with the one lever it activates the dual regenerative braking and um, it's set up together and um, the pressures of the braking are also programmable which i uh, adjusted uh, separately and they're both different obviously and then so anyways of course we've got the chrome large headlamp 1200 lumen fully waterproof you can immerse it in water it won't die got a built-in battery with a button on the back right there and of course the EVC head badge then down here we got the brake front motor and I made some really cool valve caps on this one that change color in the Sun I'll show you where this one looks very purple and then I'll show you on the other wheel it's been sitting in the Sun it's changed color already up front we've got a 80 millimeter 26 inch rim with a nine continent direct drive front motor then as we get back here we've got phase runner and motor controller which are not available right now and um, super hard to get but I've kept several for all the customers and um, then down here we've got the large chain ring with the purple chain my mom loves pink and purple so we've done this frame in pink panther pink prismatic powders and um, it has purple metal flake as you go close you can see that metal flake shines like crazy in the sun and it gives it that cool effect not just straight pink but a little bit of purple right so down here we've got the battery and second motor controller we've got a base runner motor controller in the back and we've got a 52 volt battery running a 40 amp bms this battery has 17 amp hours of volume and then back here oh we've got a 26 inch by 100 millimeter wide rim in the back so now in the rear, what we've done is we run a super, super small uh, geared motor in the back. It's a Shenji. And I've used the standard wind. Because once again, we're not going for speed here, just for control and power up the hills and that kind of stuff. So that works quite well with the setup. Also, we've got dual torque mounts. Um, I've made some custom setup here for this frame using the extra slots. Um, 
I've managed to make an easy setup to be able to slide back and forth for a chain adjustment and stuff like that and to pull it on and off makes it easy because unfortunately these motors have the wire coming out of the center um, because they're the lower style motors both front and rear are like this so you have to set it up a little bit different so then I've made custom clamps to hold the wires all in place make it all nice and clean and tidy no cut wires all plug-and-play system uh, keeps it waterproof and um, easy to diagnose stuff later too and then of course on the side same thing right dual torque mounts I'm running the quick brick tires on this one I thought it looks cool gives it that retro look with that pattern and that gives it the dual motor setup so with this setup I'm running front direct drive rear geared motor and it's about 2200 watts um, in capacity and I've divided that up um, with the tuning of the two controllers to make it operate uh, together um, giving you the maximum power and feeling and control and braking of course that you can get out of the bike and the components that are on it and here's a little sneak at the rear it's changing color there it's pretty cool anyways so that's the basis of the bike and we're gonna go for a quick rip and then we're gonna gift the bike to my mom and see what she thinks of it that's gonna be a, a fun process I can't wait okay guys this is the sickest girls bike on the planet hands down Gail I hope you enjoy this bike it's fucking gorgeous I'm gonna do some cinematics for you in three two one Hi Gail. Hi. <laughs> That's not good for the bike. Wow. What do you think? Oh my god, it's my bike. Oh my god. Oh my god. Look at it. Is this my seat? Oh my god. 
It's a beautiful color too. It yeah, matches your mask. <laughs> How's it feel? Oh, it feels different. <laughs> wow. Cool, right? Yeah. We'll go take it for a little rip. <laughs> well, the seat's not quite right. Oh, yeah? Yeah. I do want to, but like, the seat's not quite right. Yeah, it's a little bit off balance right now. Mm -hmm. Okay, next time. Yeah. <laughs> Eli Test Road is, runs beautiful. <laughs> Got my bike. Yeah. yeah. Two motors, electric brakes. Yeah. I got my. You got your Eastbound Top Cycle tattoo. Yeah. I got my clock. clock. You got a clock. I got my. You got your temperature. Yeah. Headlight. You don't, have, you don't have to pedal now. Just one mm -hmm. brake? Yeah. Front brake and be gently. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> okay. Wow, what a nice, what a nice thing. So finally you got an eastbound chop cycle.